See you in July. Hey there, everybody. Thanks for joining us on TCM. I'm Ben Mankiewicz. In 1944, Humphrey Bogart and Lauren Bacall starred together for the first time in director Howard Hawks' big screen adaptation of Ernest Hemingway's To Have and Have Not. The pairing of the two stars was an immediate hit with moviegoers, and as it turned out, Bogie and Bacall were a hit with each other as well. Not long after production wrapped on To Have and Have Not, the 45-year-old Bogart and 20-year-old Bacall were married. And over the next four years, the two stars reteamed on screen to make three more movies together, firmly establishing themselves as one of the most popular screen couples of their generation, or any generation for that matter. Up next, from director John Huston in 1948, we have Bogey and Bacall's fourth and final big screen pairing, the gripping drama Key Largo. The script is loosely based on a hit play telling the story of a war veteran returning home to America and visiting the family of a close friend who was killed in combat. But once the veteran gets to their home, a small hotel in South Florida, he finds himself going back into battle again, this time against a bunch of gangsters, using the hotel as a hideout from the law and the hurricane bearing down on all of them. The cast also includes Claire Trevor, Lionel Barrymore, and Edward G. Robinson playing the kind of sneering, tough guy role he may be best remembered for today. From Warner Brothers in 1948, here are Humphrey Bogart and Lauren Bacall on screen together for the fourth and final time in Key Largo.